Hey guys, Charlie here from worshipguitarskills.com and we just finished filming a series of videos showing you how to use the melodic math concept using triads to compose some pretty cool lead lines. Now there's five lines in total that we looked at and they all kind of build on top of each other. Now what we've done with these lines is some of them starts on the, the root note and it just has an ascending line with a combination of chord tones and non-chord tones. And I kind of show you what you can do with that. And then we also expanded that by adding some rhythmic variation and taking those same ideas but tweaking them slightly to come up with a more rhythmically driven line. And then as we started adding more rhythm to this, we realized that by taking our 4-2 variations of the triads, which is simply playing a chord voicing with your notes on the 4th and 2nd string, and we were then able to play what I called melodic chord voicing. So normally when you play a chord, it's all about the rhythm, but in this case, we incorporated the rhythm with those voicings in a specific way so that it resulted in a line that had a lot of melodic movement to it. One of my favorite ones of the series. And then our fifth and final line of this series was simply using power chord voicings, but all on the first and second strings. And we used both the root position power chord voicings as well as inverted power chords. And it had a very repetitive rhythmic pattern, but that is the kind of thing that really cuts through the mix. And it's a nice line that you can add to a verse, a chorus, a bridge, or anything for that matter. It outlines the chords. It's got a lot of rhythmic content to it. And those power chords were played on the high strings really cut through the mix. So if you want to learn any of these lines, you can just check out the description. We link out to all of the full lessons, 10 to 15 minute lessons where I expand on how we compose those lines, where the notes came from, what techniques are used, all of that kind of good stuff. You can go ahead and find the links to the full lessons in the description. Thanks so much for your support here on the channel. Um, we really feel uh, loved and appreciated by all of the wonderful comments and feedbacks that we're getting from you guys and it really helps it for myself and the team just knowing that we are creating value that's helping you in your journey of becoming really the best worship guitar player that you can be and with that i want to invite you to leave comments for us in, in our videos let us know what you are struggling with what you need help with because that way we can make sure to always create content that is going to be of maximum use and maximum value to you. All right, guys, with that, have a good one. Check out the links in the description and I'll see you in the other videos.